first What I Eat in a Day video and I'm so excited to share it with you. I'm currently in Ubud, Bali and I explored several eateries here. So let's start! My morning obviously started with breakfast. I'm staying at this really lovely homestay and they provide it. So I just had some fresh fruits and Balinese coffee. The place I'm staying at is called Dani's Homestay and for 150,000 rupiah, which is $11 per night for two people, including breakfast, it's just an amazing deal. The day I filmed this video was actually my very first day in Ubud at night. I walked around a lot and to have a little rest and also to eat my lunch. I stopped at this place called Buddha Bali. Later I found out it's a big chain promoting healthy organic foods. They not only have restaurants but also health food stores all around Bali. Their menu is full of fresh fruit juice and smoothie creations. They have coffee and creative western and indonesian food. I chose a vegetarian burger with a beetroot patty in a charcoal bun. It came with a side salad and homemade fries. Yum, look at this. The bun looked so cool and the whole meal was just very filling and super delicious. Uh, yeah, watch me eat. <laughs> By the way, all eateries I mentioned in this video I will link in the info. about you guys but after I had a hearty meal I always crave something sweet. Yeah so after I walked around a little bit more I stopped by at this place called Cafe Bunut, Bunute. I'm not too sure how to pronounce it but I ordered a fresh young coconut and I just love drinking coconuts on a daily basis the best way to stay hydrated especially when it's so hot here in Southeast Asia. stopped by at Starbucks and David ordered the iced coffee and I just had a few sips. At night it was still raining. We wanted to find a place to eat close to our homestay so we drove our motorbike and we found this Indian restaurant called Little India and just spontaneously decided to eat here. It was really cozy and I especially enjoyed the colorful decorations. It's a family owned restaurant and the owner was just absolutely lovely. I am not very familiar with Indian dishes and actually we used Google image to understand the menu. But the owner was really helpful and explained some of the items. I had a vegetarian thali plate which had a couple of curries veggie samosa and a naan bread, bread as well as a couple of dipping sauces and rice it, yeah, it was really good so that was everything I ate here in Ubud thank you so much for watching and see you soon, bye